I don't like them just I don't like them too bright but if I trust you <laughs> but I don't like them too bright does that yeah, make I don't sense do the lights. oh okay great like that probably all right we ready you ready Miss Fisher I'm ready are we ready Louie good evening my <laughs> sorry that's okay all right let's go again great Good evening. My name is Michelle Fisher and I'm enthusiastically running for the House of Representatives next November. Recently the news has been plagued with stories of politicians' indiscretions, lies, and cover-ups. These salacious scandals are not only bad for the candidates, but they're bad for America. We need to be able to trust our elected officials. The American people deserve that. And that's why I wanted to talk to you this evening, to wipe the slate clean so there are no surprises this November. Honesty is not only the best policy, it's the American way. I once told a homeless person I didn't have change when in fact I did. Didn't report my babysitting money on my taxes through college. I told my best friend she looked beautiful in her wedding dress, but she didn't. Ate my college roommate's pizza, but blamed it on another roommate said I wasn't feeling well to get out of going to Brooklyn. Never cared for Guster. I did that? Yes. When? I don't remember that. Pretended to be on an important call when I ran into my childhood best friend on the street. Didn't give an elderly woman my seat on the bus. Never once offered to chip in for gas. Never got the whole Ryan Gosling thing. I'm not that I'm not sorry for that guy. That guy's a dick. Yeah. I would kill his dog. Yeah. I, I like would. That a lot. Okay. Bought a dog to blame my farts on it. Cheated at Monopoly so the game would end faster. Bought size six clothing, even though I knew the eight would fit better. I say I'm allergic to cats, but really I just hate them. Have never flossed. Went on a Cuban vacation. Um never called them freedom fries. I claimed to have cramps and yoga to get out of chair pose. Thought Citizen Kane was boring. And then now it's like day's one hand in the grocery store. Oh my god. I don't keep to the right. Told my college boyfriend he was the biggest I'd ever seen. Claimed I didn't care about the royal baby, but made a Google alert for it. I say the n-word when I'm singing along with rap songs. And finally, I'd like to apologize to you, the voting public. Because while I'll be making a lot of promises about what I'll accomplish in Washington, once I get there, I won't make good on any of them. Thank you, and God bless America.